Denver is experiencing tremendous urban growth. And like many U.S. metropolitan cities, it has challenges with its existing infrastructure. Approved by voters back in 2004, the Regional Transportation District's RTD Fast Tracks program has provided $5.5 billion to the local economy through build-out of the region's transit infrastructure. As part of Fast Tracks, the Eagle P3 commuter rail project is a 34-year, multi-billion dollar transit expansion program to build and operate a new commuter rail service for the 2.8 million residents that live in the Denver metro region. The goal is to help provide a safe and reliable transit system, alleviating highway congestion, and connecting the Denver International Airport to downtown Denver's Union Station Intermodal Hub. You know, it was obvious to us that the, the Fleur organization had experience that we were looking for, not only in, in rail projects, but uh, bringing equity to projects, which was so important for us to be able to complete the funding necessary for this project. A partnership of RTD and a Fleur-led joint venture, the project is aptly named Eagle P3 to recognize the innovation of the first public-private partnership for transit in North America. The Eagle P3 project encompasses the construction of 36 miles of new commuter rail, 14 new stations, 32 bridges, a new commuter rail maintenance facility, and procurement of 66 commuter rail cars. As the managing partner of the Denver Transit Partners Concession, Fleur is responsible for financing, design, construction, procurement, testing, and commissioning. The concession will also operate and maintain the Eagle P3 commuter rail network for 29 years. Urban construction challenges were present, with heavy road traffic, 24-7 operation of two adjacent freight rail lines, relocation of over 500 utilities, and monitoring and securing environmental permits from multiple jurisdictions across the rail corridor. It also involved communications and power systems integration of trains, along with operator training. Floor brings many strengths to our project. The leadership capability, the management capability, the technical experience and skills, and the collaborative effort that they all bring to the table every day to make sure we're getting the project delivered and delivered on time. The DTP concession actively engaged disadvantaged business enterprises, DBEs, and small business enterprises, SBEs, in the contracting process. Floor has done a great job in collaborating with my office. Right now, we have almost 200 DBEs and SBEs participating in this contract, which is approximately $260 million being spent on small businesses. And they are a part of this huge infrastructure that's changing the face of Denver. The planning and communication on Eagle P3 was critical proactively communicating to the public, local community, and affected residents to address traffic control, mitigate construction impacts, and update the progress was a daily action. The project has garnered national recognition. In 2015, Eagle P3 was awarded the Occupational Safety and Health Administration's STAR Voluntary Protection Program, or VPP. The project also achieved the U.S. Green Building Council's LEED certification for exceeding environmental stewardship. We're having a tremendous impact on our community, having a tremendous impact on economic development, and really what we're doing today is going to leave a legacy, uh, not just for tomorrow, but 10, 20, 30, and 40 years down the road. This infrastructure is, is built to last, and it's going to be just a huge improvement and a huge success for the Denver region.